Hey everyone, it's Nick and Nikki of Nick's Crossing, and welcome back to another railroad adventure for today. And today we've been invited to Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania to take part of a caboose ride on the Reading, Blue Mountain, and Northern Railroad located kind of in the heart of Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania. Behind me is the 2013 Reading and Northern GP38-2 that operates on the line for their scenic routes. So today we'll be on these tracks for about a 70 minute journey. I'll be in the caboose and Nikki will be experiencing things from the open air car all the way at the front of the train. Then I'll be all the way at the back of the train. And when the train turns around, we'll also get footage of that. So here we go, everyone, all aboard. This caboose is hauling up the tracks, and I got all my uh, YouTube friends with us today. You guys will see them. Got Alan, Friends of the Apocalypse. We got Matt, Matt PG, up in the front of the car. We got Jay from JP Videos, RJ from RJ78, and Jamie Macon of Jamie Macon. It's gonna be a great ride. You guys saw. Oh, got some narration here. And through the entrance to the Jim Thorpe Rail Yard. Oh sweet, so we're going to get a look at the turntable. So the intro has been sabotaged. Guys, we're on a caboose right now. It's an old Reading caboose. <laughs> so we're going to get some views of the turntable coming up. Oh, here's another diesel. SD50. for the steam engine and there we go there's the other tender for that Woo. so all right guys so we're going to be on about an hour and a half train here um, you guys saw the engine that's pulling us it's a whole gp unit in the station so here we go all aboard got some maintenance away pieces oh yeah yeah they're shot a gorgeous turntable Oh, look at that. They got an MP switcher. I believe that's an MP. Where is it? Oh, SW. Oh, my bad. SW unit. Looks like there used to be another train bridge up there or something. Retaining wall.
guys. We're gonna meet up with these tracks here on the side. We said this used to be Lehigh Valley, CNJ, Central New Jersey. A lot of people, uh, a lot of us rail fans just call it Jersey Central, which is kind of cheating. Oh, there's a single bridge going up top. I think we missed it. There we go. It's the. I guess it's a disadvantage from sitting underneath the caboose like this. Oh, we just crossed over into the track, so you guys are going to get some cool views. Look, there's insulators over there. Oh, there's a bucket full of uh, spikes right there.
guys, so that was an amazing train ride. One of my favorites, actually. First time here, but we're at a different location now. We're gonna film the uh, 2013 GP38-2 going across this bridge that you guys saw during the excursion. All right guys, so this is the last filming location of today. We're gonna catch the train from inside this turnhole tunnel here, old CNJ tunnel, right outside the bike path in the park. It's um, free to visit and everything. You just walk on through very carefully. It's a little dark, so I got the light on here. So here we go. Spin you guys around for the adventure. So here's a look. It's pretty big. I bet you there was, well. It's so big. <laughs> this is one or two tracks through here. Two. Jeez, that's tight. All right, you guys can kind of see that there are rails here. Or actually ties. I'm actually getting dripped on by water as well. But the ties are still in here, you can see. There's one right here, if you follow the light. Drill marks on the side as well, pointed out by RJ and all them. Got another group behind us, so I'm gonna make, make tracks through here. Here's a bunch of ties right here, going all through. Wow, yeah, we saw that. Yeah, Jay just pointed this out. Check this out. They're using this as cribbing in here to hold this hill back. It's uh, pieces of rail just shoved in there. Look, they have arrows for, I guess, future spots. Yeah. Pretty sketchy. It's amazing. This side's pretty cool. This left side here, all the uh, ties are still here. everyone that's going to conclude this railroad adventure for today hopefully you guys had a great time riding the rails here at the Reading, blue mountain and northern 
Railroad here in Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania. Now there are other excursions, definitely check out their website, I'll post that in the description below. And also all of the awesome YouTuber friends and family, or my YouTube family that were here today, I'll have all of their channels in the description as well. Special thanks to Jay from JP Videos for getting this event together, it was such a great time. Nikki, did you have a good time? I did. That's all? No, well, yeah, it was a very scenic area. Um, I definitely would come back again. 10 out of 10 would recommend. There you go. And it's also just, it, Jim Thorpe seems to be a very charming town and I can't wait to explore more of it. Yeah, and um, we'll definitely be back for other railroad events here, especially when they bring out 425, which is the steam engine you guys saw. They've got a couple other engines waiting to make an appearance this year that uh, this railroad is very excited about. But anyways, guys, if you're new to the channel, always consider subscribing. Make sure you hit that bell for all so you don't miss content just like this. Giving the video a thumbs up and a comment really helps out the channel as well. Until next time, everyone, happy, happy railroading. railroading.